this is a different kind of pizza place. In fact, they'll tell you it's not a pizza place at all. It's a happy place. It's called Oathcraft Pizza, and they have some pretty big ambitions. Oath is really about a certain mindset. You know, the goal was to go out and, and really shake things up and uh, disrupt the pizza world. Founder Doug Ferryman is a guy who isn't afraid to think outside the pizza box. He opened the first Oath store in Nantucket last year and has quickly expanded to locations in South Station, Davis Square, and this one on Route 9 at Chestnut Hill Square. The chef-inspired, assembly line-style, quick-service concept is built around two unique characteristics, the high-tech oven and a top-secret crust formula that took years to develop. My goal was to create and maximize the senses, sight, sound, smell, touch, and I think we've nailed that with this crust. When you look at it, it looks different. We've developed a proprietary way where we can flash grill and flash sear. That the end result is a product that A, looks different, it feels different, it smells different, it actually sounds different, it's audible. When you eat it, it crunches. The bottom of the crust has grill marks. The top is puffy, golden, and bumpy from searing in olive oil. And according to co-founder Max Seal, it makes for a uniquely delicious foundation. Because of the way the crust is prepared, when it's put through the oven, it just gets this enhanced crispiness that you will not find in a lot of different concepts. And when you top that with all sorts of different toppings, it just brings together this amazing product that uh, becomes very craveable. <laughs> whatever kind of crazy craving you may have, Oath has a combination that can satisfy. There's pulled pork and pineapple pizza with a honey barbecue drizzle, Mexican meatball with jalapeno relish, even strawberry cheesecake and triple chocolate chip cookie dessert pizzas. And they're served very fast and relatively affordably, all thanks to a state-of-the-art, high-tech electric oven. They call impingement heating ovens, so it's basically like a high-power convection type oven where the pizza slides in, cooks for 90 seconds, it's basically blowing air on both the top and the bottom, which allows it to get that really quick, fast, crisp cook. You know, it has a certain air velocity, it has a certain temperature, and it has a certain way that you can program it to fit your product. And that's where some of the magic comes in is, you know, we found an oven that we can program and we can hit the button and every time it's going to come out the same. These ovens really allow us to do that. One of Oath's most popular pies is named after its inventor. It's called the Dougie, and it was built for carbo loading. The Dougie is, uh, it's almost like your potato skin on a pizza. A lot of people getting that Saturday morning after late night out, <laughs> basically. It's a seasoned red bliss potato with a really good applewood smoked bacon, a little bit of scallion at the end, and a little ranch drizzle. It's like the ultimate baked potato pizza. If you're looking to spice things up a bit, look no further than the so-called spicy mother clucker. So the most fun pizza to say is obviously the spicy mother the clucker. I mean, every day people come in and get a chuckle out of that. Yeah, the spicy mother clucker. This was the most popular pizza in Nantucket. Chicken with uh, secret oath sauce and then sriracha. So it's got a lot of uh, good spiciness, good flavors, good kick. We can't tell if people just love saying the name or they really love the pizza, but the spicy mother clucker is always a favorite. Another popular option for flavor seekers is the porky fig pizza, which just happens to be Doug's personal favorite. You know, very, very high quality mozzarella that we actually get specially diced. Black Mission Fig. We crisp up the pancetta a little bit, and then we finish with a nice dollop of creamy brie that melts out, creates like a, a mellow melt on the pizza. And we're going to garnish it with a little bit of balsamic reduction and a little bit of basil. The creaminess of the, of the brie, the saltiness of the pancetta, you know, with the sweetness of the balsamic glaze. And we do it in a way where not one is overpowering. A lot of times you can order fancy pizzas and there's just too much stuff on them, but we always try to limit ourselves to four to five key ingredients. And that pancetta and the brie and then the fig combination just come together in a wonderful harmony. So instead of eating another boring plain cheese pizza, perhaps it's time you make an oath to try something different. We love the food that we make, we love the food that we create, and we bring forth a very family type, happy type environment. When people leave that door, they have this impression of this is different. And that's our goal is for them to walk out that door with a very positive impression saying, hey, I've never had pizza like that before. Mm -hmm.